I'm back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. And if you click the thumbnail, you're probably here to check out some pentatonics. Pentatonics? I think that's it. It's somewhat pronounced like that, I'm assuming. So I'm not very familiar with this band. I was actually told to check them out because I was reacting to another acapella band, uh, Home Free. And to be completely honest, I am pretty unfamiliar with acapella groups until more recently. And I was really kind of taken aback by just the amount of cool sounds and music that you can make with just your mouth, let alone the singing part, but the beatboxing, all the other musical instruments that are there that aren't actually there. So I've been checking out a good bit of Home Freeze stuff, and then somebody just suggested that I check out Pentatonics as well. And as I was looking for songs to check out, I noticed that this one had like almost a billion views. So it might be a good place to start. So we are going to be checking out Pentatonics version of Hallelujah. Now, I don't know exactly the first person that came up with the song, but I do know I'm most familiar with it from Shrek, Shrek 1. That was a very emotional movie, and the specific scene with Hallelujah in it was fantastic. Classic, almost perfect movie making, all in animated form, and I loved it. So I'm very interested to see how this song goes. It was just a really good song, so let's give this one a go. I've heard there was a secret chord that David played and it pleased the Lord. But you don't really care for music, do you? Well, it goes like this, the fourth, the fifth, the minor fall, the major lift, the baffled king composing hallelujah.
Okay, so that was Pentatonix and their version of Hallelujah. Okay, so are we sure there's no instruments involved here? Because at a certain point when like the beat picked up or the bass picked up, I was like, there has to be some drums or a bass guitar or something like that. But I'm fairly positive it was just them that was actually making that music. So that's ridiculous. They clearly sing fantastic. They that was really interesting because they got they got a little minute for each of them to kind of shine through a different verse, and they have such different unique voices, and the pitches are so different and all over the place, but they just come together so well. It did, did make me very reminiscent of the scene from Shrek, so it got me a little emotional. But that was a very very solid rendition. Do they do their own music as well, or they do mostly covers because? I am a big fan of, well, I really like covers. It's just kind of fun to check out something you're kind of familiar with. But at the same time, if somebody's really talented, it's always cool to see what they actually do themselves. So, yeah, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. How long have they been a band? This one seems like it was six years ago, so that's a little bit. But never too late to get started, right? Let me know in the comment section. Any other ones I should check out? Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go hit that subscribe button if you would. That'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out.